the withdrawal of U.S. military troops from Afghanistan has hit its halfway mark. But even as the drawdown has reunited many soldiers with their families, Hawaii National Guardsmen with the 29th Infantry Combat Brigade are preparing to head over for a year-long deployment. KITV4's Catherine Cruz has the story. Order! Order! 140 civilian soldiers stand ready. Our island's fathers, brothers and sons face a mission that will take them to parts of southern and eastern Afghanistan during a critical juncture. These soldiers that you see in front of you will be among the last U.S. troops on the ground in Afghanistan. We cannot understate the importance of this mission. They will assist Afghan National Police during this transition. We have a small window of opportunity left in Afghanistan to help there are Afghan security forces come up to speed. Army Guard soldiers from Guam, Arizona, and Texas will make up the team of senior officers and enlisted troops who will leave behind their families and civilian jobs as teachers, social workers, and the like. The hugs and handshakes kept coming for this guardsman who heads into his third deployment. It's a lot of support from uh, my family and uh, the leadership, and you know, uh, we're all ready to just do our duty and do our job. So. Uh, it's uh, overwhelming and it's good to have this support uh, back home. Yeah. This will be the first deployment for Aaron Montalban, who will miss his two-year-old son's next birthday. Well, we're going to make it work. We're going to Skype and, and do whatever we can and spend as much time and um, talking to him and my wife and my family. Montalban's parents are proud and the advice from his father, a veteran of two wars, be alert and confident. I went through this so, you know, I, I, I know the difference, you know, so I said, hey, you have my blessing. The soldiers will soon leave behind their loved ones with some heartache and worry, looking for the day when they will come home again to stay. Next stop for this unit is Mississippi for two months of training. The unit will head to Afghanistan in November. Catherine Cruz, KITV4 News. The timeline for the complete withdrawal of U.S. troops is the end of 2013.